Okay, that's a little wider than hip width. Of course, we're going to establish our three pillars. Our, first of all, starting with our energetic coherence. We do that by pointing and reaching with our index fingers, feeling them. So just by doing that, feeling consciously, feeling the index fingers and reaching with them, we activate the connective tissue system throughout the whole body, get this, create this energetically coherent state. The whole body then is united. The energy it becomes one chi in the whole body. Now we're going to establish the central equilibrium. You want to feel the balls of your feet. Let the, the weight of the of your body spread throughout the whole foot, but primarily focusing on the balls right now. The knees are unlocked. You're sinking down into the earth, letting go of any extraneous muscular tension. You want to have only as much as you need to not fall down. So now we reach with the crown of the head and tuck in the chin and open up the jade pillow gate at the base of the skull. We're establishing two poles in opposition right here. By reaching up with the crown, we are accessing the yang chi of the heavens by sinking down into the through the feet into the earth allows the yin chi of the earth to rise to the bubbling well that's the two energy points the yang tran points uh, which are kidney one on the acupuncture meridians and that's the, our primary entry point primary gate for earth chi coming in. When you tuck in your chin and reach up with the crown, you'll feel that stretch at the back of your neck. Um, this is really helpful because it opens up the jade pillow gate, which allows for circulation to, to uh, between the body and the brain, between your torso and your brain, through your neck. And this nourishes your brain, allows for the smooth flow of cerebral spinal fluid, and allows the chi to rise to the spirit valley at the center of your brain. Relax your lower back and drop your tailbone. Okay. We take a little time with the three pillars just to be able to really firm that up. And we want to get it so that it becomes kind of automatic after a while, that this becomes a preferred state. That central equilibrium, we're accessing the big chi. So now we want to unkink the hose and primary areas. We already started that by opening the jade pillow gate. That's one of the biggest, the biggest points of, uh, of blockage in the body. You want to reach out with your elbows and this opens up the shoulder joints. Your arms are rounded. You just notice when you do that, you reach out a little bit the elbows and notice you get a bit more chi flow in the, in the hands. Now we want to Focus on the quad, so you just spiral down, turn, and just you're turning from the hip joints. So notice I'm not turning from my shoulders, I'm turning from the hip joints. And that frees up the quad, allows the quad to get very soon or, or re released into the structure. So that allows the energy between your legs and your torso to flow more freely. Just spend a moment and feel the chi flow in your hands and your arms. 
You'll notice that your mind is clear and you're calm and centered. And this is the effect we're looking for in the three pillars. It also allows us to access an effortless power. We're not using our own chi as much as we're connecting up to the big chi. Bend your wrists, go on the ball to your feet, reach with your wrists, and then lift your fingers and push out with your hands and pull back a little bit with your with your body. Go into your go into your heels as you reach out with your hands. And feel those poles in opposition. Your hands are extending outward and then a young movement. The body moves back in a yin movement. Now you pull back with your hands, reach back with your elbows, and your body goes forward into the balls of your feet. So your hands are now moving in a yin way. They're moving backward. Your body is becoming more young and it's going forward. Again, we have the poles in opposition. Push out, sink into your heels. Feel that. As you reach out, you want to reach out also with your elbows and feel your back opening up. Feel that space between your scapula opening up. Feel the connection, the immediate connection between your hands. They're all part of one system. Response is instantaneous between them. Pull back with your elbows, go forward onto your ball to your feet. Pressing down with your hands. into the balls of your feet and reach up, palms up, gathering. You want to get up about shoulder, neck height, fairly high with your hands, although your elbows are dropped, shoulders are relaxed. You reach out with your elbows and open your back, reach forward with your fingers, pull back with your body and your heels, and reach out there and feel those pulls in opposition now. now. Pull back with your elbows, back with your hands, forward with your body into the balls of your feet. And feel that energy. Reach forward. Back into your heels. Open your back. Feel your shoulder blades spreading. Your back is opening. Think of your heels in. Allow yourself to settle into that and feel the yin energy sinking down into the earth. You're settling down even as you're reaching out. So the body is yin and the hands are young. Rotate your forearms and press down. Reach down with your elbows. Down with the wrist, sink into your heels. And 
and hold your hands at about belt high. Reaching out with your elbows. Yeah. And bring your hands down. Sink into your heels and relax. And feel the energy circulate. Okay, so that was just kind of a warm up there. That's now we're gonna do the now we're gonna do the dragon. Dragon yearns to fly but cannot. All right, so reach up with your wrists. Reach forward with your fingers, back with your body into your heels. And just feel into that. Feel the effect of those poles in opposition. Continue to reach up with the crown of your head and tuck in your chin. Continue to open the jade pillow gate and relax your lower back. Knees unlocked. Now pull back with your elbows, forward with your body into the balls of your feet. Feel the effect of that. Yeah. Now go to your heels. Sink, reach forward with your hands. And carry. Reach. With the balls of your feet, reach out. Pull back with your your body, open your, open your back, reaching with your elbows, reach with your fingers. Feel your fingernails, you want your hands to kind of, you want like you're grasping with your fingernails as if they're, they're dragon claws. You want to feel that. And this enhances the wood chi. This feeds your liver and also feeds your, your sinews, your connective tissue system. And pull back with your elbows. Go to your heels, reach out. Stand. Open the back. Now draw your elbows back. Sink down and reach out with your hands. Thumbs down, elbows out. Really reaching out with the elbows, opening up your back, opening up your shoulders. Extending the fingers, feel those fingernails. You're sinking into your, uh, your stance, you're relaxing your lower back. And really feel sinking down. Open. Sink down, 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 leaning forward. Your, your back is rounded. You're coming down and sinking down. And then your hands come up, crossing up over your head. And sink down and reach up with your fingers. Bend forward, 
Bend your wrist, reach up, and you're, you're trying to fly here. You reach up at the wrists, relax your shoulders. Take your head down now. You're bending forward, rounding your back, opening your neck. You're reaching with the neck, and then you come down, and fingers come up, and you're just like you're, oh, you're flapping your wings. Body straightens up. And sink. Bend forward again. Reach up with the wrists. Sink. Feel your weight in your heels now. And then uh, flap those wings. You're really extending the arms, opening. Hands come down in front of you. Feel the, it's kind of a neutral posture right now. Reach out. With your hands, sink into your heels. Open, reach with your elbows, open your back. Sink and lift your hands. Rotate your forearms, palms down, feel those claws. Reach out with your elbows, open your back and you're bowing forward and pressing down with your hands. Feel that back rounded, open up between your shoulder blades. You're pressing down with your hands, you're reaching with the crown of your head Rotate your forearms as if you're turning a, two big knobs with your hands. You're, you're turning these big knobs, one clockwise, one counterclockwise, as you stand, straighten up. Fingers come down. Step in. Sink into your heels. Allow your body to get very yin. Feel the energy cascading down you into the earth. Like a big waterfall. Take a deep breath. Inhale, go into the balls of your feet. Gather. Sink at your heels, reach down with your elbows, down with your wrists, down with the fingers, and throw all the chi away. Discard it, empty out, dissolve into the mist, into the emptiness.
Let's do that again. And step out with your left a little wider than hip width. Get a wide, stable stance. And establish your three pillars, your energetic coherence, your central equilibrium, your, you want to open, you want to unkink the hose, feel those fingernails, those claws. Also, you want to feel your dragon tail, like this, if you got a long tail reaching out from your coccyx. We're not doing a lot of turning here, but still good to feel your tail as a stabilizer extending out behind you. And that connects up to the spine. So your whole body is connected and extending energetically behind you. Okay, so sink into the balls of your feet, reach up with the the wrists, reach out with the fingers and sink into your heels. Your hands are yang, your body is yin. Go back with your elbows. Feel the, you're pulling back, you want to feel those claws kind of grasping at the air, at the space. You're kind of raking the space with your, your fingernails as you do that. Your hands are young, your hands are yin, your body is yang now. You're in the balls of your feet. You're into the heels. Reach out with your hands and carry. Okay. And reach out with your fingernails. Feel those fingernails grasping at, at the space in front of you. Your body pulls back. Shoulders are open. Your elbows are reaching. Your back is open. Reaching with the crown of your head. Think into the balls of your feet. Elbows come back. Hands come back. Bowing forward. Arms go out. Sink down into your, into your stance reaching out the hands you want to actually kind of separate you want to not here but more out more out beyond your shoulders elbows reaching this is a big kind of uh expansive posture here you open your back open your shoulders and just feel the chi in your hands and your arms feel it throughout your whole body that sinewy vibrant energy that's moving through there. And then arms come down, bow forward. Hands come down, cross and coming up. Up, 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 open. And ah, uh, sink. Fingers up, reaching out, open, extending, opening your back, opening your shoulders, opening your chest. Go to the balls of your feet and your arms. Wrists reach up, fingers drop. You're bowing forward, actually going to your heels on this one. 
Good, your heels, as you're reaching up, you're soaring now. Coming up, body straightens up. Arms flat down, fingers up. Balls your feet. Sink into your heels, bow forward, reaching up with the wrists. Sink back rounded and then uh, coming up, flap down, fingers up. Hands come down. Sink into your heels. Heel in neutral posture. Feel the yin here. And reach out with the fingers. Reach out with the elbows. Open the back. Hands come up in the balls of your feet, reaching, opening. Sink, bow forward, rotate your forms, palms down, bow forward, round your back, pressing down, and open, reaching out with your elbows. Feel your fingernails and rotate your forearms, turn those big knobs and body straightens up. Feel the chi in your hands right now. Those knobs, a couple of turns, you yeah, just feel that, that connection. So we're creating Jin here. That is the ability to express the energy with the body. Hands come down. Yeah, very soon, very... Very yin, body sinks, put your heels, relax, and step in. Take a deep breath, go into the balls of your feet, hands come up, sink into your heels. Reach down with your elbows, down with your wrists, your fingers, throw it away. Empty out. 